PRGF preparation. Transfer the citrate tubes, eight of them, uh, to the centrifuge station. Open the centrifuge and place the eight vacutainers in the appropriate slots. Close the lid securely and we'll set the speed. Um, in this case it'll be 460 G and set the timer for eight minutes. And while we're waiting for that to spin, we will mark our transport vial at four and a half milliliters. And this is the appearance of the vacutainer. After the spin, we're going to very gently remove the top so as to not mix the uh, red and white blood cells with the plasma. We're going to pipette off the plasma and transfer that to our transport vial. We will fill that up to the four and a half milliliter mark and secure the top and we'll be moving on to the next station. Ultimately, we'll go ahead and use calcium chloride. We'll fill a repetitive dispenser. And prior to injecting into the tooth, we will add 0.5 milliliters. We'll click once only and release. And then we'll replace the lid and invert the vial. Clinically, you would then uh, stimulate bleeding in the tooth and then syringe the PRGF into the canal. And eight to 10 minutes later, you will have a fibrin clot form inside the canal.